it's me. I'm back staring at this default blue and white FreeCAD UI, also known as the Labyrinth of Suffering, also known as the Toolbar Nightmare, also known as Who Needs Healthy Eyes Anyway? You know what that means? Yes, it's time to push my free product again, that is Vertical UI. And this time, the developer of FreeCAD Link made it ridiculously easy to switch. Come along, I'll show you how. We'll start by downloading a zip file that contains the style sheets we're going to use. Then we're going to merge a configuration file. And uh, that is actually it. Amazing, isn't it? Okay, here's the vet UI zip file. Unzip it, open it up. You can copy over the GUI folder to your users free CAD folder on Windows that's users username app data roaming free CAD and on Linux I think it's home folder then dot free CAD folder. If the GUI folder already exists you can merge it or overwrite it if you had Vert UI installed previously. Now I have this fresh installation of FreeCAD link open and if we go to tools edit parameters you will probably notice that there are a couple of new buttons here. Now before we touch anything, I would like you to do a full backup. That is ridiculously easy to do. Just click export, name your backup, and click save. That's it, fully backed up. Now in order to load vertical UI, click merge from file, go to vert UI folder, and select the vert UI file. Okay, things changed, but we're not quite there yet. Let's create a new file, and let's cycle through these workbenches. Now, if you encounter toolbars that are misplaced, or the tree view not being visible, or any other funky stuff, you can simply merge the configuration file again, and that should fix all your problems. It's actually very useful to have that file at hand, just in case you mess up the UI and you want to revert to vertical UI again. Go Tools, Edit Parameters, Merge, that UI, that's it, they're back. I recommend you lock the toolbar so that doesn't happen often. Now we can hide the workbenches we're not going to use. That's pretty much it. Vertical UI in its full glory. Just like that. You will notice that there are a couple of toolbars at the bottom. That's because RealFender, the developer of FreeCAD Link, has revived the status bar from the dead. You can now slot toolbars and enable or disable elements, such as the uh, navigation settings. Oh, and one more thing, I actually included the Pi View menu. You can enable it by going to Customize, Toolbars, Global, and assigning a shortcut to this Views toolbar. I prefer Q. That's about it for this video. I expected it to be a bit longer, but since the process was so easy, I'm not going to waste your time. You can download FreeCAD Link for free and support this absolute beast of a developer on Patreon if you can. Thanks and see you soon. Bye.